Good morning, Longhorns. I'm Hank. And I'm Enrique. And today is Monday, October 31st, 2022. It is Halloween. <laughs> Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge, pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to these Texans. One state, under God, one and indivisible. Now for a moment of silence. This moment of silence is dedicated to Miss Baboon's advisory class's pet balloon, Chad, who has died to deflation last Thursday. Now for the Be The One Pledge. I must be the one by making choices that represent good character. I own all my responses when I'm interacting with others. I am a product of my thoughts, words, and actions. I will never settle for giving anything less than my best effort. I know that in order to grow, I must expand my mind and engage in the world around me. Holly Ryan Middle School Longhorns have pride and character. I am a proud Longhorn and a person of good character who will always do my best to be the one. This weekend we had two birthdays. Today we had three birthdays. Happy birthday to Ava Chukwu, E, um, Luke R, Jackson A, Jarek T, and Mustafa K. Happy birthday, Longhorns. Please come to the front office to spin the wheel for a prize. Today is National Doorbell Day, which makes sense because today is Halloween and you ring doorbells to go trick or treating. Plan to make them give you candy no matter what. Yes. Mm -hmm. Today consists of sunny skies with a high of 76 degrees and a low of 56 degrees. And today for lunch, we will be having crispy beef taco with rice, four cheese pizza, pasta with meat sauce, green beans, salsa dipping cup, seasoned potato wedges, taco salad, fancy red apple, pear cup, sugar cookie, and fresh brains with your choice of chocolate or white milk and dressing. A few friendly reminders. Um, we need empty plastic water bottles. Please donate them to the bin outside of the library. Do not forget to keep reading and logging your books. Please do not come to check out in or out books from the library during first advisory, only during Longhorn time. Do you have a suggestion, idea, or feedback for us? Take the media team survey. It can be found in our weekly newsletter. The media team has a weekly s'more newsletter that, you, that can be found in the library canvas course under modules. It has a lot of cool things and you might even be featured in it one day. And November 14th is open mic night from 5 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. You can sign up in the link in the, in the library canvas course under the module titled Mike Night. You need to press book now to sign up. Mr. Brummett um, will be the MC. You can do singing, dancing, play an instrument, tell a joke, read a poem, etc. Only three people have signed up. We need more people. Yes, more now. Please remember to keep your Crocs in sports mode. If they are not in sports mode, that is against the dress code. And um, spelling bee signups are open. The online qualifier test is also available to take. Do not cheat. Or else. Yes, or else we will eat some different kind of meat. <laughs> and um, <laughs> I'm just kidding. And check the your Canvas announcements for more information. And now for our Longhorns of the Week. I'm Adriana, and the Longhorns of the Week were chosen by the core team. Miss Enriquez chose Christian Ware in Izabendi and Chimeli uh, Chidozzi in Altarismo. Miss Bailey chose Elijah L. in Revert and Mariah G. in Altarismo. Hey. Miss Wynn chose da Jason Dean in Revert and Heidi Pan in also Revert. Miss Yaki chose Jalen S in revert and mia g in revert miss bishop chose drew james in alterismo and hosanna d in amistad and miss johnson chose tristan flores in isabendi and celine mccurry mccurdy in alterismo and now for the teacher of the week the teacher the teacher this week we chose a certain science teacher in the house of Amistad. Congratulations to Miss Broussard. 
we will be knocking on your door during exploratory time to bring you a certificate and a prize wheel for you to spin. And um, for our daily dose of jokes, this joke comes from Adriana Cavallo in Amistad. How do you say beautiful in the ghost language? How? Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Good job, Adriana. Good job with joke submissions. We have more than 160 submissions, and we are fully stocked up with jokes. And congratulations to Miss Gad Voice and Coach Minkle for getting engaged. Good job. <laughs> yes. Yes. Good job. That is real. We're, this is not an April. This is not. This is not, not April Fool's. Because <laughs> it's not April. And um, thanks for listening. Have a spooky day, Longhorns. Stay cool, calm, and collected. And for the love of me, learn something or we will come for you. Good morning, Longhorns. I'm sorry this is late, but I'm bringing to you today the winners of the character pumpkin contest. It was very difficult. We had several people coming in and judging. So for first place, um, we have... Willy Wonka by Liam Lyon. Good job. And then um, The Wings of Fire from uh, book number four by Sophia. And in second place, we had uh, Narnia Aslan with, um, by Jack. Um, congratulations. And third place is Dogman by Matthew. So congratulations, Longhorns. Please come to the library to collect your prizes. Thank you.